हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट मॉडर्न एज मेनली द पोएट्री ऑफ मॉडर्न एज मॉडर्न एज स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम अ ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी पॉलिटिकल हिस्ट्री वर्ल्ड वॉर विच वॉज स्टार्टेड इन नाइनटीन हंड्रेड फोर्टी एंड नाइनटीन हंड्रेड एटीन इमर्जेंस ऑफ न्यू नेशंस वीमेन राइट्स इशूज दीज आर सर्टन फैक्टर्स विच डॉमिनेटेड द थिंकिंग ऑफ मॉडर्न एज पोएट्री एज फार एज लिटरी हिस्ट्री इज कंसर्न वी कैन से दैट मॉडर्निजम हैज अ मेजर लिटरी मोमेंट इट स्टार्टेड इन अर्ली ट्वेंटी सेंचुरी इट इन्फ्लुएंस बाय चार्लस डार्विन एंड कार्ल मार्क्स थीरीज साइकोनेटिकल थीरीज नो कनेक्शन विथ हिस्ट्री Why this moment actually started? The main reason is that when writers felt they require a new form of writing, there was actually a dissolution of Victorian ideas, beliefs, and their way of writing. The this age is also called as the age of disillusionment, the age of machine, the age of innovations, the age of interrogations, the age of war, the age of disintegration. Ironian satire as a tool of point of faults problems within society important characteristic of modern literature or modern poetry is that it is it is an opposition of the victorian writers at the end of victorian era there was felt the need of change in the sphere of literature the modern writers could no longer write in the old manner writers of the 20th century saw the coming feature of the golden age there was also an artistic experiment in the form of literature this victorian ideas of permanency was replaced among the 20th century writers by the sense that nothing is fixed and final in the world the victorians believe in the sanctity of the home life but in 20th century the sentiments of family life decline science and arts really influence the modern man psychology also influence this period the psychoanalytical theories of sigmund freud became more popular and widely read modern poetry t s eliot was one of the dominant figure during this age his wasteland which was published in 1922 is considered as the milestone in the history of english literature it was totally against victorianism and romanticism the 20th century poets who were in revolt against victorianism in the 19th century poetry the main characteristic was preoccupation with a dream world under the new conditions modern poets could not take dream habit uh, seriously matthew arnold is also one of the uh, main poet of uh, this age matthew arnold was not qualified to give a new direction to the poetry browning had no aptitude to understand the complexity of modern life it was essential that a new technique of communicating meaning was discovered which brought about the movements known as imagism and symbolism in modern poetry modern poet exercised to get a freedom in choice of new themes use of new and wide range of subject themes and uh, issues features of modern poetry it was totally against the victorian and romantic poetry the disappearance of religious faith regular meter have been discarded no regular rhyming schemes juxtaposition of ideas use of free verse use of irony and use of metaphor these are some of the features of modern poetry